two nations which are the biggest threat to USA are Russia and China. China is the pacing challenge. They are actively working to erode U.S. competitive advantages, and the U.S. Air Force is pursuing a number of upgrades and modifications to address these new challenges. Streamlining and updating the fighter fleet has been a particular focus, and many U.S. fighters are still under development but will take to the skies in the foreseeable future. So without further ado, let's take a look at the eight upcoming fighter aircraft of USA. Firstly, we have the F-16 CD Block 7072. A large number of variants of the General Dynamics F-16 Fighting Falcon have been produced by General Dynamics, Lockheed Martin and various licensed manufacturers. The F-16 CD Block 7072 will feature a 12,000 flight hour service life. The latest and most sophisticated F-16 production variant combines capabilities and structural enhancements to provide the most advanced F-16 production aircraft yet produced. The twin-seat aircraft will be equipped with the AN-APG-83 Sabre AESA radar, and Block 70 may be powered with a single F-110 GE-129 engine, while the Block 72 may be powered with a single-engine F-100PW-229 engine. Up next is the F-15X Eagle II, which is an improved version of the twin-seat F-15C fighter jet of the U.S. Air Force. The F-15X features all the latest technology, as well as the capacity to carry 22 AIM 9X Sidewinder and AMRAAM medium-range air-to-air missiles. Boeing claims the F-15X can carry over 13 tons of weapons and fuel under its wings and fuselage, far more than any fighter in production now. Other enhancements, according to Air Force magazine, include a much more powerful mission computer, new cockpit displays, a digital backbone, and the Eagle Passive Active Warning Survivability System. The U.S. Air Force expects 144 numbers of the F-15X jets after 2024. Up next is the F-A-18EF Block III. The U.S. Navy's Block III Super Hornet is a development of the Super Hornet aircraft that will allow it to operate alongside the F-35C stealth fighter far into the 2030s. The Block III will incorporate advanced Super Hornet's characteristics, such as conformal fuel tanks and network sentry capabilities. The Block III aircraft will have a 9,000-hour airframe, enhanced stealth coating with reduced radar cross-section, an inner fuel tank mounted infrared search and track, and a high-speed communication connection. The new aircraft may be powered by more powerful engines and other technological improvements as well. Up next is the EA-18G Block III. The Super Hornet Block III structural enhancements will be incorporated into the EA-18G Block III electronic attack aircraft. The next-generation jammer will be installed on the aircraft, allowing it to operate in difficult electromagnetic conditions. The EA-18G Block III will be capable of handling more data and transferring it more quickly than the existing Growler aircraft. In addition, conformal fuel tanks will increase the range and time on station. According to U.S. Navy plans, the whole Growler fleet will be upgraded to the new Block III standard. The first aircraft was upgraded to Block III in March 2021, and it is scheduled to return to service before 2025. The F-35 is expected to be continually upgraded over its lifetime. The first update, known as the Continuous Capability Development and Delivery or C2D2 in short, began in 2019 and is expected to last through 2024. Block 4, which would incorporate new weapons, particularly those specific to international customers, upgraded avionics, increase ESM capabilities and include remotely operated video-enhanced receiver or rover capability is the C2D2's near-term development priority. Up next, we have the F-36 Kingsnake. The F-36 will be a non-stealthy aircraft that can still use low-observability technology and current technology, 
such as the F-22 Raptor's F-119 PW-100 engine, where it could achieve a peak speed of Mach 2. The King Snake can be equipped with an ANAPG-83 Advanced Electronically Scanned Array Radar, which is the same as the one used in the new F-16, as well as an infrared sensor device derived from the Legion Electro-Optical Targeting Pod. The King Snake, like the F-16 it would replace, would be a multi-role fighter capable of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions according to popular mechanics. Missiles and guided bombs would be carried in internal base as a non-stealthy aircraft. Both would be carried on wing-mounted external hardpoints. Up next is the next-generation air dominance. This is a sixth-generation fighter programmed with the objective of developing a family of systems to eventually replace the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor. In March 2018, the U.S. Air Force Research Laboratory unveiled a depiction of the FX, indicating that the aircraft will feature a sleek, stealthy design with a high-energy laser capable of cutting enemy aircraft in half. The program, which aims to improve air supremacy, may see the FX fighters deliver considerably improved stealth capabilities and collaborate with unmanned vehicles. The NG-80, or Penetrating Counter-Air, will have a greater range, larger payloads, and the potential to carry hypersonic missiles. Lastly, we have the FAXX. This is a development and acquisition program for a future sixth-generation air superiority fighter to complement and eventually replace the United States Navy's FA-18EF Super Hornet. The total payload capacity as well as the range and variety of weaponry and equipment of the FAXX will at least match or likely rather exceed the current platform that is Super Hornet's payload capacity and capabilities. Maximum sensor connection and electronically programmed smart skins are among the next-generation technologies that might be explored. Its renderings and concepts showed a stealth two-seat twin-engine tailless jet with a blended wing fuselage. Featuring a tandem cockpit, it has canards which usually comprises the frontal radar cross-section, but the lack of a tail shows an emphasis on all aspects stealth. The aircraft must be capable of operating from Navy Nimitz-class or Gerald Arford-class aircraft carriers. And that, guys, was the 8 upcoming fighter aircraft of USA. We hope you've enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to hit that notification and subscribe button for more videos from the buzz.